we are back here on the clearing job. A lot of rain, so we weren't able to come up here. And then we had some issues with the hydraulic cylinder on the 130. So, as you can see, I got the side-by-side -side here all decked out with tools. Um, so, we got a little bit more force emulsion up here to do. We got the pull saw. So the plan was today, we got a patch of dry weather. The plan was to go in here and hog that out and start bringing in uh, dirt, our fill dirt and everything. We just decided it's too muddy. It's not gonna be worth it at this point right now. Uh, the customer's in no rush to get the drive in. Yes, it'd be nice, but uh, we're gonna hold off right now on the drive. Look at this lovely mess. Uh, guy doing the part test, drove his x ray right through there, right up through the field. It's hard to find good help these days. Hard to find good help. That wasn't our guys. That was not us. <laughs> so, to get some speed here. Go. Yeah, we are in full drive. Good grief. We made it to the top of the hill. Last time in, <clears throat> when we were up here. Uh, so what happened, real quick, what happened to the excavator here? The bolt, the nut that holds this ram in there, it fell off. That's the second time it's happened. So they got a new like locking nut on there. So hopefully that won't happen again. So we kind of been down up here working on some other stuff. So the customer's house is gonna be right here. Big old windows facing out this way. <clears throat> and they don't like the cedars. Uh, you know, we were cleaning up around them and trying to make them look good and everything. But as you can see, there's a lot of red X's on there. And uh, they said they don't wanna keep them. So like there's some throughout there. But pretty much all these, they just want to get rid of. So, uh, instead of pushing them over, like we pushed over a couple of them and they were really uh, busting them up bad. So Josh is gonna go through and drop them. And they, I mean, the stumps come out no problem, but like whenever you're digging around it like this right here, that would split like way up the side. So we're trying to save this lumber out of them, you know, leave, save the logs and sell these logs. So um, he's gonna cut them and drop them, cut them to length. I'm gonna be kind of jumping back and forth in the excavator, helping him. And then I'm gonna keep grubbing out up here. So I'm gonna put you on the old uh, helmet up here. Don't have the clip for the helmet. We thought we did. So I'll set you up here and you guys watch Josh uh, cut this stuff up.
So what I'll do, I'll take this stuff that's sitting right here, put it over here because that's getting dry. Our logger tapes are in the other trailer. <laughs> oh, sorry, a little smoky over here for you. Ah, Lose my the head on that thing. Hey, Josh, cut about a foot or two off that. See that end? Pretty rotten. Right,
going to switch. He said he's having a blast. Yeah, fly that thing. We'll find out, won't we? <laughs> so, it's actually my brother's drone. Should we tell him? Tell him what? Tell him what? <laughs> <laughs> Won't you tell him? Tell him what? About the other drone. Oh, so a week or so ago, Dave met me out here. He was going to give me a crash course on how to do the drone, how to fly the drone. So he gets it going up in the air. He shows me this cool feature where you can um, have it circle, do a 360 around something. So he shoots it up there. He's doing it. And it gets stuck in a tree <laughs> on the neighbor's property. <laughs> like way up in a tree, like 100 feet. <laughs> Pretty sure it's still in the tree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've been checking. So we got a, a new one and hopefully... Hopefully I won't get stuck in the tree. <laughs> what you think, Harley Dog? Come here. Hey girl. Alright, Jody's gonna play around a little bit with an old drone. Alright, so what we got going on here today is uh, a little update on the progress. This is the area where Josh got all them trees out yesterday, cut all them cedars. They want to leave those as far as I know, but we do have to get that corner out right there. We went through and pulled the stumps out this morning, threw them on the fire, and then I went down over in this area here, 
and uh, this over here is they're they're gonna try to get this in grass so this will be graded out and smoothed out and everything but kind of from this edge down they're just gonna uh, they just want it forestry mulched so I went through and touched up areas um, there was some stuff down there finished it off uh, they had those trees marked so I just cut them down with the grinder and then we have to um, kind of continue cleaning up that edge right there so that's kind of the plan oh my goodness is to uh, just kind of work our way down here and they had some perk holes done just keep going down this edge leaving some of the bigger trees so that's what we're going to work on today. Mm -hmm. 